Thanks, Monty. I'll try not to cry while I'm doing this. Somebody, Some, somebody get, uh, get Monty a scotch, please. The, um, you know, it's, um, it's an important time and, and um, something that, that uh, some of us have lived and know is that if we can bring uh, resources and be principled about moving things ahead so that it, if it's better medicine is one of, one of the phrases we like to use. If it's better for the patient, no kidding, and it's better for the provider, the surgeon and the institution that's involved in providing, then it'll be better uh, for the company uh, and hence the investors and so forth. And so this, um, there's low hanging fruit here. Uh, there's a lot of progress that we, that we can make and, and and it's exciting to kind of morph the model a bit. It might be a little bit controversial about what are we doing creating a for-profit in an overall nonprofit field. Um, but, you know, you have uh, the assurance from us that we're going to do it really, really well. Always thinking about the patient, the surgeon, and then uh, uh, the rest of us will do well. And as we do well, as investors will build such value for site life that they'll be more resourced than ever to, to provide global, uh, global support as, as uh, Monty has outlined. So I just wanted to review that and I, I mentioned on the video there that uh, something that I admire um, and aspire to is to be involved in mission-based progress and mission-based innovation. I have the good fortune of being on the board of directors of the leading heart valve provider in the world. It's called Edward Life Sciences. Uh, Lowell Edwards invented the heart valve uh, 47 years ago or so. And um, the, the progress that's been made in providing um, efficient, uh, effective, uh, heart valve replacement in, the, in those decades has been amazing. My estimate is that nearly $10 billion was invested in order to make that progress. Sometimes it's hard to do that as a nonprofit. You know, where do you find the money? But periodically you can. But what we know, <clears throat> and we've done it uh, thankfully a few times and helped a lot of people, is that we can, we can raise capital from investors that care. Do they want to need, uh, make money? Of course. That's the way they fuel uh, and, and fill their responsibility. But often, uh, some of us that are investors or entrepreneurs or business people prefer and are biased toward areas where we can make a positive difference and create value at the same time. And, and, and this is a, a, going to be a fun, uh, exciting uh, uh, opportunity to do that as well. So that's kind of the acceleration that we were talking about. Um, maybe with all of that uh, outline and overview, are we ready to, to do the panel? Uh, so thank you for that, and I see Steve Slade is here, Dr. Lindstrom, and Audrey is here, so please come forward.